a leap of faith, um, I wrote a leap of faith um, because people need hope. Uh, people need hope. Hope is being able to see past today. Right now, if you look around, people are hopeless. They don't, they don't, they don't, they don't see any a way out of the situation. You know, they don't, once again, hope is being able to see past today. And growing up to teenage, being born to teenage parents, being evicted 10 times, uh, being fired from two different jobs, um, being able to start in a new business with no capital of my own, moving from one city to another city, not having staff, the one thing that sustained me was faith and hope. And my father told me that your life is not for you. Your, your life should outlive you. He said it's not about us, but it's up to us. And so for me, that, that resounded in my mind, that it's not, it's not about me, that I needed to share my story. I need to become transparent because if I made it through that, if I made it through being born to teenage parents, being evicted 10 times, being, uh, being, being fired from two career jobs, um, starting a business with no capital, my hopes is that someone can look at my life and say, if he can do it, I can do it. Tough times don't last, tough people do. And so I'm a messenger of hope. I want to give hope. I want people to look at their bank account and don't focus on that. Stay focused. I want people to, someone who's going to read that book and they're going to, they just got fired from their job. And they're going to say that, you know what? I didn't get fired. I got freed. You see, because I got fired from a job before.